Hi guys. Um, this is going to be a really quick video. Um, I want to show you guys how I bleach my hair. Um, there's probably a million videos on YouTube of how to bleach your hair. And mine's probably not any better than anyone else's. And um, But I mean, I figured since I'm about to dye my hair that I would um, just film a video of me bleaching it. And then I'm also going to film a video of me putting the color in my hair and like the before and after picture or something like that. So probably this, most of this will be, some of this will be talking, but also some of it will be sped up or something like that. So, um, just because I don't want you to have to watch like a million hour video. So, um, first thing I'm doing is I am just, um, brushing out my hair. I'm also going to have to section off the pieces that I don't want bleached, but I'll show you how to do that, uh, well, I guess right now. So, what I'm trying to do is I'm, my mirror is here, so I'm going to be like looking, okay. Um, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to bleach everything but the black that's in my bangs. As you can see, I have purple, I have purple and black, and I guess that'll be okay if there's a little bit of purple. But I'm going to re-dye my black soon anyways, so it doesn't matter. So I'm just going to do the best I kind of can with this. I'm going to... Um, just trying to section this out. Okay. And I'm just going to take a bobby pin. And I'm just going to clip back my hair like this to get it out of the way for right now. And then on this side, I'm just going to do the same thing. And then just kind of like picking through what I want to keep, what I don't want to. God, some of this is like really purple. Okay. Okay. And I'm just going to bobby pin that back as well. To keep it out of my way for a minute. Um, so, next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take some small rubber bands. Just look like this. These are cheap as heck. And they break and they suck, but whatever. I don't, I just use them for this. Okay, whoa. Okay, so what I'm going to do is that part I don't want to bleach. I'm actually just going to... Uh, twist up into little buns just so it's like out of the way and I'm just wrapping the rubber band around it and just making it into a little clump so you see you can just get it out of the way there and then I'll do the same for this chunk here just kind of twist it up Make sure everything's just kind of tight and out of my way. Um, when you bleach, you also want to make sure that your hair is dry. You don't want to bleach wet hair. It doesn't work. Um, yeah, so that's all the way. I know I look crazy, but whatever. Um, and then I'm just going to take out my, my bobby pins. And I'm going to start the bleaching process. Okay, so, um, what I have here is a packet of bleach. Um, this is the Satin Ultra Smooth Powder Lightning Bleach. Um, and it's the blue powder lightener. And you always want to get blue because, um, the blue helps take out the yellow. Like, I'm putting green in my hair, so it doesn't really matter, but yeah. So, it looks like that. And, um, you're just going to pour it in your bowl. And don't breathe while you do this. Because you're breathing all the particles and it's going to suck. So. Okay. Okay. Um, and then, 
Um, don't use 40 volume. 40 volume is much too harsh for your hair. Um, use 30 volume. This is mine. It's just normal by Mrs. K, Miss K, whatever. Um, bleaching developer, and it's just a 30 volume, like I said. And what you want to do, okay, usually what you would do is you would put kind of like equal amounts of this stuff, and you'd want to measure it out, whatever the packet says, but I'm just going to eyeball it. And so I'm just pouring it in there, and I'm just going to keep adding a little bit more until it looks about the right consistency, and then you just want to stir it up. This also isn't going to be enough for my hair. I have other bleach as well. So I'm just showing you this part because it will just be easier. So I'm stirring it up so it looks like this. Oh, geez. I almost lost it all. And I'm just going to add a little bit more of the developer. And the consistency you want is not runny. You don't want to do runny. But you don't want to do too thick either. So, about this consistency, okay? So it's thick. And it's really strong, so do it by a ventilated window. So I'm just going to do this right now, and then I'll make um, I'll make the rest later, and then I don't need to show you that because you'll get the basic idea, but I'll show you what it looks like afterwards. But So I just use a thing like this. Um, I also have a glove that I need to grab. Hmm. Hold on. in one of these. I hope so. You're always going to want to use gloves because your hands get screwed and it hurts. If not, just try to do it really... Here we go. Yeah. Gloves. Okay. So put your gloves on. And I'm just using my brush that you can just buy at any... Um, beauty supply store fine and um, uh, I'm just getting it on my brush and I'm just gonna start with my roots and I'm just gonna put it on there I don't know if my camera just turned off hold on let me check no, it's still recording. So basically what you're just going to want to do is you're just going to want to put the bleach all over. Um, uh, usually they suggest not putting it right on your scalp, which I would suggest too. It totally burns. But for me, I just kind of break the rules just because I want everything to be like super light and the color out. So I don't know. Follow the rules. Don't be stupid like me. But, um, yeah, you, you just basically, you can section off your hair, um, just kind of get it done. Uh, sometimes I just, like, I'm like, fuck it, like, let's just, like, put blobs in it and just, like, rub it through, and I don't know. But whatever really works for you. The, the main thing is just get it on everything and, um... Get her on there fast because it, your scalp will probably start, oh, sorry, can you not see me? Your scalp will probably start to burn because this stuff is brutal. Like, it can hurt, but, I mean, whatever. Just deal with it. It's okay. So, and then I, what I do is I just kind of go back through and I just rub it in with my hand and get it done. And the back you just kind of have to feel out because, um, I mean, you could try, you can get a friend to help you, but I don't have anybody to help me, so I'm just doing it like this. So, um, I'm going to put the rest of the bleach in my hair, and then I'll, um, I'll be right back. Okay, so bye. Hey guys, so, um, I finished.
finished putting the bleach in my hair and kind of just looks like this. Big messed up. Um, okay, so, sorry, the fumes are killing me, but, um, basically, um, for me, since I have colored hair, the color comes out quicker with bleach, so I'm probably going to only leave this in for about 10 more minutes, and then I'm going to rinse it out. Um, like you can see already, it's like most of the color is gone. Um, I only really want it light enough so the green will go in it and I'll be okay. Um, but if you're trying to go from like black to lighter, um, I would leave it in for about half an hour. Um, and you don't really want to go any more than that because it's going to really damage your hair and you really don't want damaged hair. It sucks. So, um, yes. Yeah, so I'm going to leave this in for 10 minutes and then I'm going to wash it out and I'll take one more video to show you what it looks like. And, um, it's not going to be bleach blonde. It's probably going to be yellow and gross, but that's what I need is just light enough. Sorry, I can't do a video to show you how to get bleach blonde, but I can give you some tips that I do know how. Um, probably at the end of this video. Okay, bye guys. I need to get to a ventilated area because the cow breathe. Hi guys. Okay, so um, I washed out the bleach and this is what I'm left with. Um, as you can see, it's like blonde and it's got a lot of pink in it. Um, the reason it has so much pink in it is because, well, your hair has red pigments anyways, and so every time you bleach your hair, it's going to come out like an orange color. But, um, I had pink hair for a while, and the pink, you know, is kind of like, it's got some, a lot of red pigment in it, so it sticks in my hair really well. So, um, this is basically kind of like what was underneath that, um, turquoise and purple color. Um, you can see I still have a little bit of purple left in my hair, but that's okay, it doesn't matter. But, um, yeah, so basically this is the finished result. Um, I really like this light pink, I think it's pretty. And, um, one day when I have enough guts, I will, like, bleach my hair in a series of, like, two months or every two weeks, um, to get my hair white. So I can put, I want to put like a baby blue in it or like a baby purple or even like a really light pink. But it's a pain in my butt and I don't know. That's why I'm just going to keep with color and not put black over it because one day when I do want to go like white white, then it'll be easier because, oh my gosh, going from black to white is just like impossible. Like I remember I did that a while ago and then like my hair just got shorter and shorter every time I bleached it because it got really damaged so I had to... I cut off the damaged part and it just got shorter and shorter until it was like it was like this short and I was just like ah which is fine I like short hair but you know I'm trying to grow it out which I doubt it'll ever I don't know it's pretty long for how I've I always cut my hair but um I'm trying to grow it out but with the constant bleaching and constant dyeing of it it's gonna take freaking forever so anyway so that was how I bleached my hair um I'm going to go dye it green now, so I'll make a new video for you guys. And, um, yeah, if you have any questions, then you can ask me below. But, really, it's just kind of like put the bleach in, leave it in to not too long, wash it out, uh, condition it. That's another thing. I left, con I put conditioner in it, and I leave it in for, like, 15 minutes after I bleach. Um, just to try and help, like, give it some nutrients and stuff, because it just, get so screwed up with bleaching bleaching like destroys it but anyways okay so that's it um i love you guys I'll talk to you guys later and if you want to see where i go from here which will be dyeing it green then i mean yeah i'll post the link below i don't know when it'll be there but it'll be there eventually so yeah okay i love you guys mwah, mwah, mwah.